guys and gals. What's going on, everybody? It's Big E. I'm still alive. I have survived COVID. Barely survived it. This is my second episode since uh, being sick. Uh, almost two weeks ago now. We're back on Beard Fist. This is our troll hunter. There he is right there. Hey, man. How's it going? Hope you guys and gals are doing well. Let's smelt up a little. <coughs> this episode, I'm going to clean out the bank, or uh, clean out the bags here. And we might do a little running around, turning in some of these oddball quests that we can turn in. Maybe pick up some new ones. We will see. The reason I have all the leather scraps in my bag is because I was going to start the episode over at the leather working trainer. And I was going to drop one of my gathering professions. Pick up leather working. And then convert all of this over to light leather. But it occurred to me... Both of my my uh, gathering professions are pretty high. We have over three gold. I'm doing well selling the materials. I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing here. I'm just going to keep selling the materials. And I'll buy whatever I want off, off the auction house to make it a hopefully survivable run here. We'll see. I don't know. Now, these are back-to-back -back episodes for me, the one that you saw yesterday. So I am still obviously quite sick. Um, but that little recording I did, it kind of lifted my spirits, and I'm feeling, I'm feeling better than I have in uh, like two weeks. So I figured, you know what? Let me take advantage. I'll get a couple of episodes done. What am I doing? We're going to go see the Hunter Trainer. Because I realized I'd leveled up. And I... First of all, I forgot to pick a talent point. As you can see, we are four or five lethal shots. We're going to max that out. And then probably come down to mortal shots or something. We'll see. But there's some uh, Hunter abilities that I can pick up. <clears throat> and we're going to do that. Here's Omrock. What do you need? How you doing, brother? We're going to pick up Aspect of the Hawk, rank 2. We're going to pick up Serpent Sting, rank 3. And I don't care about Raptor Strike too much. <clears throat> we're not, we don't do a lot of melee because we're a hunter. I do care about Wing Clip. That's really what I care about. Put a Wing Clip. If something comes into melee range, we Wing Clip it and then we try to kite out. Maybe put a concussive shot, and then hopefully the pet picks up. So I'm going to kind of hold off on this stuff for right now. That does not mean that I am not going to melee on purpose to try to keep up the skill. My, uh, you know, my axe skill, but I don't think I care about multi-shot for right now. And I don't really care about the rest of this stuff. Go with honor. Let's go see. Level 18, I should be able to buy a few things. Talk to me. For him. Yes. Pick up both of these. Stay away from the voodoo. Can he get any of these? How many train? We have. Yeah, he can get both of these. So we'll give him great stamina. He's not high enough level. He needs to be level 18. Okay. He's a level below us there. So how far does he have to go here? Where's my pet? He's almost there. We'll give those to him when he levels up. So this episode, here's what I'm thinking about doing. What are you thinking about doing, E? I'll tell you. I have a quest to turn in here. I have a quest to turn in in Ratchet. I have a quest here. <coughs> 
I think what we're going to do, we're going to come out of Ogremore through the side gate, uh, the west gate, I guess. We'll come across this way, we'll turn this in, and then we'll come do some harpies. It's not what I was going to do, but it makes sense to me now that I'm looking at the map. But we need to go to the bank because I have to get rid of... Uh, some of this stuff. I also purchased, I bought new pants and a new belt. Yeah. Look at that. Wait. Yeah. This is what I had. <laughs> I was like, did I buy the same thing? No. Got a extra agility on the pants we're wearing, and then I bought an upgraded belt, uh, belt 20 extra health, and four additional agility, which is perfect. What did I just do there? Did I just drink something? <laughs> it sure looked like I drank something, didn't it? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I did. I don't see like a new buff or whatever. Looks like I was drinking a alcoholic beverage. Anyway. Hope everybody's doing well today. I'm not sure what day it is this comes out. It might be a Friday or something. I'm trying to get myself healthy, trying to get back on track. And I don't know why, I, what I'm doing. We'll go up this way is where I wanted to go. Is it faster to fly to the crossroads? I don't know. I don't think so. Maybe it is. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The bank. I cannot forget this. Give our business to Coma. He never, nobody ever pays attention to him because he's way over here. McGraw. Mock Grow. So, <clears throat> I'm kind of stuck with these ruined leather scraps. And, um,. Let's see. Give me that. Let's see if I can sell this stuff. These are still, like, auctioning. I mean, look at that. People are still selling these for less than you can vendor them for. I'm just... I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know why I don't want to get rid of these. <laughs> but I'm just holding on to them for right now. Anyway, let's go sell all the rest of the stuff. Um, these are cooked. I'm actually going to... Let's get these out of the bag. I am actually going to... I'm going to sell this stuff. I'll save the clam meat. Go forth to victory. I'm just going to vendor. We can fish the better food. Like this, uh, you know, the 552 food or the higher. Because our fishing is a little bit higher. As a matter of fact, our fishing is 150. We could go get the book if we wanted to. Booking is 150 as well. Yes, it is. All right. Let's see here. Let's see if... What's light leather selling for? You vendor it for 15. I did learn that you do get a deposit back if it sells. You don't get your deposit back if it doesn't sell. So you keep that in mind. I think that's how it works. This light leather pretty much always sells, though. As long as I get more than what you can vendor it for, that's all I really care about. Just barely there. Slight... Yeah, it's a slight profit. We'll take it. Mm -hmm. 
A little chunk of change right there if we can sell it. Is this still the same? Oh, this has actually gone up a little. I should take advantage of this. Why does it say... Why does it say I can make more at a vendor? I make seven. I see, because of the deposit. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, I'll just vendor that. We'll just vendor the rest of this. <laughs> I do want to have a look at wool cloth. Um, just to see. That's not too bad. I'm going to buy that up. I'm going to buy that. And I'll buy that for the same price. A silver apiece. Let's go... Ah, uh, Gammon's been slain. Poor Gammon. I was going to say, let's go kill Gammon. <laughs> and then I was pretending like I felt sorry for him. Because he always gets his ass whipped. Hail. Congratulations. Big XH. Congratulations, my friend. One copper? Oh, I, I see it. it, it well, it, it's one copper per, so I see. It's not as bad as I thought it was. It's still pretty bad, but... All right. Go in peace. I'll go in peace. But here we go. Um, Let's make up some of these. Three hundred heals three hundred over seven seconds. That's not too bad. We get a wing clip on something, we get into trouble, the pet's dead, we use super sticky glue, we run out of range, and we can potentially heal up there. We hit 140 here? Maybe. We did. Nice. All right, well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Let's just hearth to the crossroads, I suppose. Probably going to regret doing that. Here. Good job. <laughs> wow, thank you. I am pretty good at hearthing. I appreciate the support there, the moral support. And it's like my guy saying it to me. <laughs> I don't know, maybe he's being sarcastic there. Good job using the Hearthstone. You're really good at this game. Thank you. I try. Let's go, Borfist. <coughs> yeah, now... As far as the professions, like I said, I, I I'm just gonna stick with what I have for right now. Bobby HC, congratulations. Is that Ricky Bobby? What I might do though, 
when it starts getting serious, I may consider dropping skinning, picking up engineering. We'll hang on to mining, obviously. We'll do mining engineering. Because I've heard uh, target dummy is just completely OP. You can also make some pretty decent stuff. The goggles or whatever. So maybe that'll be the play. And I've mentioned that might be the play before. And especially if we get to a point where we're not worried about gold anymore. I mean, you know. All I'm really using it for is to train up, repair my gear, and uh, buy a little something something off the auction house. That's really it. Not sure when the webcam's coming back on. Maybe sooner than later. I've just, you know, because I'm sick, I'm just not feeling presentable, you know. Also mentioned last episode, I, I shaved off my beard, just... It was driving me. It was just, I didn't need to be dealing with it uh, when I was sick like that. I got, just got tired of it. And I, I just happened to be in the bathroom at my worst. Looked in the mirror and it was just looking just all out of control. Not trimmed. I just, dude, I, I reached in the cabinet. I took the clippers and just... 10 seconds that thing was off of my face it's all it's not trimmed very nicely <laughs> it's not looking good right now and you guys know like once you've had a beard for a while and then you shave it man it it looks pretty fucking weird right it does your chin always looks like way smaller than it is and your face always seems to be more round <laughs> Well, spit it out. Keep it real. Fifteen nugget slugs? If you ever need anything. A little flirty, aren't you? Like, I'm a man. There's only one way I'm going to take that. I think you mean a pervert. No, I mean a man. You did that same thing. It's the same thing. No, it's not. The same thing. Okay. Not all men are perverts. I mean, most of us are. But not all. That's right. Okay. We're going to see about some harpies. Come along. On a magical journey. How does that go? I'm pretty sure it's a Coolio song or something. I don't know. What is, like, where's the hunter? That's weird. Oh, right there. He's a troll, man. You good, bro? As a mage. Mage is always good. I'm going to take you over here and show you something. If you're doing a hardcore challenge and you're using the HC add-on, you won't be able to use the auction house. <coughs> but there is a NPC over here, Frang Wildgore. This guy sells greens. Yes, he does. I'm not going to say it's the Alliance equivalent of Antonio Pirelli, but he can have some different things, and they do change, just like Antonio's. His items can change up. Strength and honor. As you can see, this guy currently has five things. He has feral blade. He has maces. He has pants. So, for the more, uh, just something to keep in mind. You can't use the auction house if you're doing that kind of challenge. 
those guys are allowed. Look at that. It looks like somebody messed up. <laughs> they bless, they put they put their agility <laughs> scroll on him. Can't tell how many times I've done that. There's also a little uh, you can do some smelting or whatever, you know, right here. Smelt up some silver. Make a little love, get down tonight. <clears throat> Yeah, the more I think about it, I probably will end up picking up engineering. Uh, um, but at one point, what I'll do is I'll stop selling um, for a little bit. That way I can get my engineering up. I'll just put the mats in the bank. Oh my gosh, the skins. Oh my gosh, the skins. <coughs> Now, if I really want to do that with engineering, what I need to do is look at a guide. Or, well, I should look at a guide is how I'll word it. I should look at a guide to figure out, like, how much copper I'll need, how much stone, blah, 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 to get to whatever level I need to get to. Put that aside and then sell the rest of the stuff, right? That would be the way to play it. That way, I'm not moving on into Stone Talon Mountains and beyond and then having to backtrack for copper and stuff like that. Alrighty, what are we looking for in here? We're looking for Witch Wing Talons, which I think come off any of these fools. We're also looking out for the Elite that patrols around here and there are ambushers which are stealthed and I'm pretty sure it was touch me Nancy said that they have an ability they have execute <laughs> that's not a good ability for an NPC to have in my opinion but we'll do our best to not be in melee range so we don't get executed I don't want to be executed by an NPC. Let's pop an agility pot here. Which wing or harpies do run, so we'll put our concussive shot up there. That was a little too early on that concussive shot. Let's actually do a little melee. Use the old axe here. What's our axe skill? It's uh, 83 of 90, so we we got a ways to go. I can also do this. Wing clip is way better than concussive shot. Get our axe skill up. Didn't need to do that. The witch wing variety. It's my favorite kind of talon. get her out of the way. She looks a little bit scary here. <clears throat> what a chump. Yeah, she's a chump sickle.
We'll have to come back here for the Slayers and the Metallicas and the Megadeths. Yes, I never fail to remember to use that joke. We don't really care about the Anthraxes too much. We do care about Panteras. Okay, that's enough. Okay, uh, he is ranked up. Let's give him Stamina, so he's got 486. He now has 506 health, and let's give him the Armor. Bam. Beautiful. And I have a piece of fish that's been in my bag for weeks. It's perfectly fine. It's basically fish jerky at this point. I don't think boars really care too much about the freshness of food. I mean, I don't know. I'm not an expert on boars, but I think they're eating it. Whether it's one day old or 30 days old. They're just like, throw that shit in my face. I want it and I need it. What was that? Thought I heard something behind me and it freaked me out a little bit because I was taking a sip of a drink. Mm hmm. One of my viewers, one of my lovely viewers, sent me a care package, several boxes, and it had something in it. I mean, everything in it was just so thoughtful. It really was. And I, I'm just, my mind's just still blown that I have people on the channel who genuinely seem to care about my well-being and trying to help me get better. Anyway, there was something in the package that I've never had before. It's called Pedialyte. I thought it was like for like kids. I've seen it in grocery stores and stuff. But it's it's really good for you as far as hydration goes. I just got it today and I have been sipping on it. It's like a um iced grape flavor is what it's called, I think. It is absolutely delicious it's absolutely delicious now my sense of smell is still kind of not smell well, yeah my sense of smell and taste are still off but it's just starting to come back after like 11 12 well 10 days 10 or 11 days but ooh boy did you see that shield right there Anyway, man, I'm I have so much medicine. I have more medicine in my house than I have ever had in any house in my entire life. I really felt like people cared. And that's that's a big thing, man. Cuz I'm not really somebody who I don't really think about stuff like that. You know, I'm just a, I'm just a man by himself. I've just kind of always been. But it, it made me feel cared for. <laughs> Got a rogue and warrior there, I think. What a combo that is, man. Thank you so much. Good job. <laughs> That's so weird. That's so weird. It sounds a little bit sarcastic. <laughs> that little add-on. Oh, man. So since I've done two episodes back-to-back, -back, I, I can tell I'm kind of at the limit of... Um, is this guy in trouble here? He is wanding. 
No, he's fine. That's a priest. That's oh, a mage. I'm kind of at the limit of my speaking capabilities. Anyway, I'm sipping on uh, that Pedialyte. Just a glass, got some ice cubes. I've all I have been able to drink is water. It's like really all I had in my house. That's all I wanted. When you're sick, you don't. I don't know. I would just avoid sugary bullshit. Honestly, just get water in your body. Now this does have a little sugar in it. I did notice, but. I eat so little sugar that I'm honestly not worried about it. It's, uh, it seems, well, it feels very hydrating. It's also got some added stuff. I think it's got vitamins and minerals in it. What the hell is going on here, man? <laughs> All kinds of shit happening here. It's the way to do it, man. Look at that. Two hunters. What a combo that is. Double hunter. Like, you're never going to be into melee, are you? <laughs> Double taunts. and Now, the way to do that, if I was had a double hunter combo, I would have one pet would, would have growl on. The other pet would have his ability on. So you'd have the one pet taunting. With plenty of focus, the other the other pet just... What are you doing, man? Fuck off! The other pet just using the special abilities. There's no way this thing's going to be up. There is a rare mob that can be in there, but... Um... Yeah, we're heading back to the crossroads, I believe. How are we doing on time here? We're like a half an hour we're doing we're well we're doing fine be careful here the event has been triggered <clears throat> this is so fucking risky man this guy's dead yeah that guy died I don't know why you would do this. Look at look at this hunter right here. I mean, I guess they're in a group. Is she going to live? You kill enough of these and then the elite mob comes out. And he is no fucking joke. What is it, Rock Lance or something? Oh, he lived. Holy shit, I think this guy lived. Yeah, we got a group here. Watching. Did she live? No, that's the so that's the druid I saw seen up, so he did not live. That's a different druid over there. I don't know, man. You're you're just asking for death. Unless you're in a group of five, I I would not recommend doing that. That quest.
Wouldn't mind having this ring, but this is the one that we've we've seen this mob a few times. Hezrel. <coughs> we might do that. Well, if that turns green. Might try to like burn that mob down. It's a pretty decent little ring. <clears throat> Well, I'm gonna have to call the old episode here, I do believe. I'm pretty between this episode and the last episode. This is as long as I've sat up for. I gotta I gotta lay down. Mm -hmm. Speak, friend. Melnon. Is that soul bound? It is not. We might be able to sell that on the old auction house. We will see. Let's go turn these in, and we'll get the follow-up. For the horde. For the horde, brother. Next episode, maybe we'll head back up. I am forsaken. Blood and thunder! Blood and thunder. For the horde! We just hit level 19. I didn't even realize we were that close. Well, there we go. We have max lethal shots up. Increase your critical strike chance with ranged weapons by 5%. Oh, we have to spend 15 points. So we got to spend 5 points before we can get down here. So we're going to be doing aimed shot... Improved Arcane Shot or Hawkeye. Reduce the cooldown of Arcane Shot by 0.2. So, uh, 2, 4, 6, 8. And that, so we can get that to a second. The cooldown on that. Quick Wizard Math. So just, it just goes to 5 seconds. I don't really feel like that's that big of a deal. Aim shot is probably what we'll pick up, but that I still have to get f uh, four points somewhere else. I could also use improved hunter's mark, which maybe this is what I do. Increases the range attack power bonus of our hunter's mark by 3%. We can get that up to 15%. Maybe that's what we'll do. We'll make a decision. When the time comes. The time right now is time for me to go lay down because I'm feeling like I'm going to pass out. That's it for me, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for tuning in, for watching. There will be another episode tomorrow, I do believe. Take care, Beardfist and I. will see you then. Smear you later. Peace. <laughs>